how to create subdomain in blogger hey guys welcome back to techiraj youtube channel in this video i'm gonna be showing you that how you can create subdomain in your blogger so guys before proceeding further i just want to make you sure that subscribe my youtube channel and that click on that bell icon so that you will receive all my latest update so let's get started हेलो दोस्तों यदि आप अपना खुद का वेबसाइट बनवाना चाहते हैं तो हम प्रोवाइड करते हैं वेब डेवलपिंग डिजाइनिंग सर्विसेज हमारी टीम से वेबसाइट बनाने पर आपको मिलेगा फास्ट एंड क्वालिटी सर्विसेज 24 फोर इंटू सेवन सपोर्ट एडसेंस अप्रूवल वेबसाइट दिए गए डिटेल्स पर कंटेक्ट करें और आज ही अपना वेबसाइट बनवाए थैंक यू सो द फर्स्ट थिंग यू हैव टू डू इज यू हैव टू लॉग इन टू योर ब्लॉगर अकाउंट एंड देन यू हैव टू क्रिएट ए न्यू ब्लॉग so first i'll show you my subdomain so that you will be sure that i'm not lying and i'm not making the fake videos so i'm gonna uh, show my uh, subdomain i'll view my blog okay so this is my subdomain as you can see the nagamedia.nagamis.com this is my subdomain you just zoom it and then see this is my subdomain and then if i type nagamis.com then my domain custom domain address will appear i'll put the www.nagamis.com so nagamis.com is my custom domain address where i have created my subdomain so this is uh, as you can see nagamis.com so like guys i'll tell you how you can have your own custom domain so the requirement to create your subdomain is you have to have a custom domain name in your blogger and then only you can create a subdomain so like the first thing you have to do is uh, you just log into your blogger account then click here on the you know uh, your domain address and then what you have to do is you have to create a new blog new blog you just uh, type title anything a b c or i'll type a b c n a g a and then blogspot.com a b c a naga.blogspot.com so this is available so make sure your your you know your, your blogspot address is available so like guys first you have to create a blog on blogspot.com and then later we will redirect to our subdomain so now you create your blogspot.com site so like my blogspot site is gonna ready now so it is ready so now what you have to do is no thanks click on the no thanks so now what you have to do is you have to go to your google domains okay this is the address domains.google okay so click on the manage my domain once you click on the manage my domain you will enter your domain address you know you can manage your domain address from google domains so guys i am logged into my manage domain account now what you have to do is you also have to log into your manage domain account as you can see my domain is nagamisnews.com as i have shown you earlier right so now what you have to do is you have to click on the dns button so once you click on the dns what you have to do is what you have to do is you have to create a subdomain here okay now what we will do is we will create a subdomain so our subdomain is uh, whatever your subdomain is i'll type just abc and then dot nagamisnews.com right and then this is your subdomain okay host name we are adding host to the subdomain first okay so now what we have to do is we have to type our ipv4 address if you do not know what is your ipv4 address then you just go to what is my ip dot host and then you'll get your ipv4 address you just copy it and then paste here and then click on this add button right after clicking on the add button your your subdomain will add to your host okay now what you have to do is you have to create your uh, subdomain and then you have to redirect to the url okay now what is our subdomain our subdomain is abc and then our destination url destination is the ur url which is uh, we have created a new block right so you just uh, click on the view block so this is our url redirected url you just copy it and then go to your google domain and then paste here okay so once the people visit so we are converting this url into this subdomain right i hope you are getting my word so what you have to do is you just click on add button now so once you click on the add your subdomain will be added to your host account okay 
so successfully save change to domain settings so it is saved now it is saved now what you have to do is you just go to your blog and then go to setting and after going to setting what you have to do is you have to add now what you have to do is set up a Google domain URL for your blog now what we are going to do is we are going to add our subdomain which we added on our host abc and then nagamis.com so now what you have to do is click on the save button okay settings were successfully saved as you can see as you can see block address it was earlier abcnaga.blogspot.com but this link will be redirected into abc.nagamisnode.com our new subdomain address so like guys it will take around 5 to 10 minutes to appear your subdomain okay so we will click on the view block now we will click on the view block but the site can be reached but guys wait for 5 to 10 minutes let's wait for the 5 to 10 minutes then your subdomain will show up okay so guys i post my video around 15 to 20 minutes now i'll check my subdomain is ready or not let's click on the view block and then as you can see it is opening abc.nagamisnews.com so my subdomain is ready now it is connected to the host so guys this is how you can create your subdomain in blogger i hope you like the video if you like the video do not forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to this youtube channel till then bye bye have a great day